hello everyone welcome back to another video so in this video i will tell you how to fix iphone software update failed and error occurred downloading ios iphone users occasionally run into a problem updating their iphone software there are a few common errors that may show up when attempting to update to the latest ios on iphone so i'll tell you how can you fix this problem so let's start the video without wasting any time but first subscribe to my channel and hit the like button so the first thing you should go for is try again the first thing you can do is try again just tap the close button on the error message and try downloading the update again if that doesn't work you can try back in few hours or the next day and the next thing is ensure a good network connection check the following suggestions for wi-fi or cellular then try downloading the update again make sure you don't have other devices connecting to your hotspot and you are done and the next step is turn vpn off if the vpn is connected then turn it off for this you just need to go to your settings click on it and here you have a option of vpn click on it and if it is connected then turn it off and you are done and the next thing you should check download latest version of iphone by using wi-fi the best way to download and update is usually through wi-fi and the next step is download using cellular data you can update using cell service to do that turn off wi-fi go to your settings click on it and then click on wi-fi and just turn it off and now turn on your mobile data and try again and you are done and the next step is make room make sure you have enough room on your iphone for the update you can check how much space is needed by looking at the update in settings and in software update the update size will be listed under the ios version and the next step is delete the update and try again there could be something wrong with the update file on your iphone to delete the update file from your iphone open settings and then tap on general and then select iphone storage find the update in the list and tap on it tap delete update and then restart your phone and then you are done after you delete the update file try downloading and update again i hope this solution will fix your issue and also let us know in the comments below if you have any questions see you in the next video thanks for watching